I was thinking about how do you satirize the current moment without necessarily being so specific? How do you think about it? Well, it sort of in the difference of how do you think about the weather versus how do you think about the climate? So I was trying to figure out, was there something about the climate of our current political system, the, the larger systems at play and how those systems are incentivized that create the kinds of outcomes that we're finding, the sort of more corrupted outcomes. So rather than sort of focusing on, you know, a Trump-like figure or a, a political figure that's, that's taken off, you try and think about it from a systems perspective. It really is about uh, the current system of where is the money? How is the money incentivized? Whether it be for the media or for the political parties, what is it that's corrupting and polluting uh, the kinds of discourse and outcomes and policies that that might arise from that? And and where does that money go? And and how is it used for its own influence? And how does the system protect itself? Steve was really the only. I I, I really did write this for him and and with him in mind. And so I'm very glad that, that, he, that he wanted to do it um, because it's, it's a difficult character because it's what do you do with someone that you might, who might believe in, in what they're doing ideologically, who might be very principled, but they live in a world that is less principled. And what does that do to them? I really love this process. Um, having come from sort of topical and daily television, which was really fun and challenging in its own way, but forgiving in the sense that, okay, Monday show kind of sucked, but Tuesday will be fine or Wednesday, or, and it, it just keeps going. And in some ways, this is a more emotional process because you work on something for such a long time before it's realized. And then as it's being realized, you bring in uh, people like Grace Yoon and Alex uh, Boverd and Bobby Bukowski, and they, elevate what you had written through production design and costume and, and cinematography and watching that happen after spending so much time with it, just kind of alone is a really, it's, it's, uh, it's emotional. It's kind of invigorating, like all this time and you just have these 30 days to get it all done and watching everybody come together and the actors and the, and the set and all those things elevating it, uh, is, yeah, it's, 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 it's very exciting. <laughs>